Hey guys, it's been a while, but we're back at it today with Magnum Allo, Hammer TA Rules. So I don't really like the start of this quest. You kind of got to rush to him as fast as you can before the bulls get to him, because you really want to land an impact crater on the roar. Uh, I'm running earplugs with a dragon heart build. So I try to land an imp impact crater at the beginning and then get hit, hopefully take enough damage and then hit him in the air to get the KO. So impact crater. And here I'm gonna sharpen. I have protective polish, so it's a little bit of downtime while I'm waiting for him to hit me. There we go, and we'll get the KO. I have two levels of slugger. If you have three, the opening impact crater will actually knock him out already, and you don't want that. So I'm running two levels. It really helps to get the third KO at the end of the fight. So now you don't have to waste time sharpening because of that protective polish. And for the ride, I'm going to take him to Aknizom because he can light him on fire with his fireballs. It doesn't always happen, but if it does happen, it's some nice free damage. Just get those wall bangs as soon as possible. So there we go, he's on fire. And I'll do an impact crater. And then here, I'm never sure what he's going to do. So he's doing his tail attack. I could have just kept going left, but I want to be fancy. So left, right, juke him out. So one more hit and he's going to be KO'd here. So I decided to guard point that into uppercut. And then we'll just go big bang and then impact crater. So he still doesn't have the hellfire on his back here. Usually instead of doing his swiping attack, he actually puts the hellfire on his back, but he decided not to. So I couldn't do a spinning bludgeon there. So now I'm just trying to get the Hellfire off. But you'll see, I actually had a pretty hard time getting it off. I don't know why, maybe someone else knows why sometimes it comes off right away and sometimes it takes a lot more hits. Because I had a bit of a hard time here. But this is perfect, he's gonna roar. So instead of doing an Impact Crater, I actually went for the Spinning Bludgeon because he's gonna stagger there just to get the extra Golf Swing and a lot more KO damage. And the Hellfire has got to be close at this point. So there I tried to sneak past him, but his paw kind of got in the way. But it really worked out, because I got to grab the wire bug anyways, so it didn't really matter. So here we're finally going to get that off. And you have enough time to sharpen, and then go into an impact crater. Because it's a bit hard to find a good opening to sharpen in the fight. So that's kind of ideal. I just wait until I get the Hellfire topple and then sharpen. Even if I spend a little bit too much time in blue, I think it's still good. So there, an uppercut, a little bit more KO damage. Because at this point, I actually haven't hit his head that much, so I really want to make sure I get that third KO. So now he's weak. And I'm not sure what he's going to do here. Luckily, he did that attack, which is perfect for Impact Crater. Got a little lucky there. And we got the KO. And at this point, I'm pretty sure he's going to die from a big bang into Impact Crater. Luckily, I was able to hit his head with most of these, because he's kind of in an awful spot. There, and he's dead. So final time, 349. I actually tried this for a while. It just This quest is a bit frustrating, because you got resetting for spawn, the bulls at the beginning, Aknizom can not put him on fire. So this could be faster still, but there's just so many things that can go wrong in this quest that I just wanted a sub 350, but it could probably be a decent bit faster still. So I'm just showing my set. Uh, my charm is, if I remember now, Wirebug Whisperer 2 Earplugs 2 with uh, two slots. So... Kind of got lucky on that one, because <laughs> I'm on Switch, so that's, that's a pretty lucky charm to have. Wirebug Whisper is really good for this fight, and Earplugs is actually pretty good too. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I'm not dead, <laughs> still alive. Uh, I'm really excited for Sunbreak though, I plan on playing that lots.
I just have been busy with real life, but I hope to be able to play a lot more soon. There you have it, 349, final time. Thanks again for watching. See ya.